The Saints controlled the ball for 36 minutes against Seattle last week, and the defense only surrendered 13 points. Time for Saints football. It's time to talk Saints football with the one and only Stephen Wiley. Well, we had a good day last Sunday, didn't we? Hi, I'm Steve Wiley. Welcome to 70 Seconds of Saints. If it seems like I'm in a really good mood, that's because I am. All right, the Saints have got a shot at getting to the 500 mark this week against the San Francisco 49ers, and hopefully the win over Seattle gave them a little momentum. I was so thrilled to see that Tim Hightower carried the ball 26 times, rushed for 102 yards. I think we can expect to see more of that this week against the 49ers. If you think our defense is bad, ho, ho, check those boys out. They're last in the league against the rush. They're surrendering 185 yards a game on the ground. Past three weeks, they've played Arizona, Tampa, and Buffalo and surrendered a total of 111 points. Now, if you're not too good at math, that's 37 points a game. Well now, are the Saints going to win this game? Even though it's on the West Coast and we don't have a great history against Frisco? By the way, I've hated the 49ers forever, as long as I've been a Saints fan. You may be too young to remember, but they used to play in the same division. We had to deal with Joe Montana twice a year, Steve Young twice a year. But the 49ers are in disarray right now. We're not even going to talk about the Kaepernick National Anthem business. I don't want to go there. I have one thing I do want to say about all this stuff. We're hearing absolutely nothing about the fact that Odell Beckham, when the Giants played Minnesota, in the pregame, military personnel were being honored. Beckham walked the sideline and shook hands with every one of them. We don't hear about that, though, do we? All right, back to the matter at hand. I'm sorry, I digress. The way I see it, this game is the Saints game to win or lose. We'll be right back. And now it's time for Steve Wiley's Pick of the Week. Okay, time to bust open the fortune cookie. Poe says, be patient. Second helping come to those who wait. Now, we had a serving of success last Sunday. If you and I are patient and wait until a late Sunday start, I think we're going to get what we're after. I'm Steve Wiley. Thank you for joining us for 70 Seconds of Saints. For more great content, click right here. To subscribe, click here.